Hey guys, Names here, and today, as you can see, we're actually, I'm actually not with RG2 Gaming or Robbie, uh, playing some tech it, but I'm actually here today to show you guys how to install the flans mod, flans, plane mod, guns, that kind of stuff. So, let's get this started. First, which one do you want to scroll down? Until you see servers, alright? So, this is for 1.5.2, alright? So, here we go. You want to download Flans Mod right here, top one. Wait for AdFly, five seconds, don't click anything. Alright, should say skip ad, right when you hit skip ad, should. Oh, you gotta click download. Don't click here or anywhere. Just click download. You should get Flans mod right there. Okay. X uh, that. Alright, so now you wanna just. Alright, you wanna just drag that to your desktop. And then you wanna go. Back, sit back and leave this page. And you want to go back. So once you got that, you're good. But there's one thing that you need. You do need this in order to use the vehicles and I think any mod part of this. Sorry if I sound weird, guys. I'm uh, it's 5:30 in the morning right now. You need simple parts back. So down with that. There will be a good amount of downloads depending on what you do, so just to let you guys know. Okay, and download. Okay, X, and then drag that to your desktop. this page. Take it back down where I was. Nope. Good. So now you got all the packs starting from simple packs. So you can get flans, yield, that. But for right now all I'm gonna do is the Flans mod uh world uh world war two pack so world war two pack okay just wait for this as well as the modern weapons pack skip ad Ooh, decently sized one just so you guys know So, as you can probably tell, I don't know how it's going to pop up, but I'm using this uh, screen recorder thing. So it's probably going to have a big watermark or something like that. So with that, I'm sorry, but that's what I could find for that was easy and quick. So I got the World War II pack. Now I need the uh, modern weapons. So I'm done with that. Sorry guys, I gotta do this every time just so I know I got them all accounted for. So now that I have that, I do have a desi, uh, messy desktop, so I apologize for that. Okay, so now you got that, what you want to do is you want to go to Google. And you want to type in Minecraft Forge. Okay, 
No, don't click on this, click on Minecraft Forge Downloads, okay? So, as you can see right here, we have the... Let me go down. You got all downloads. This is where you want to be. You got 1.6.2. We are not downloading this, okay? If you remember, this is 1.5.2 mod, so you want to scroll down. Look, 1.5.2, alright? Download the latest version. So, it's right here. Download the universal. Make sure you do that, or it won't work. So wait the five seconds. Skip the air. Right now you have Minecraft Universal, Minecraft Forge Universal. Okay, so right grab that, and now you can close your web browser because you're done with that. So. Now, what you want to do, you want to, since I'm running Windows 8, you want to hit the Windows plus R. You want to go to, open up that percent, uh, data percent, enter. Mine, my, dot Minecraft is at the bottom. Here's maybe at the top, just depends. With that, go to bin, go to the um, dot jar file open with winrar archiver so you will need win winrar 7 zip works as well but I like winrar alright so now you want to open up the minecraft forge put that right there alright so first thing you always want to do when installing mods for minecraft delete the meta inf right here okay yes to that so once that's gone, you want to copy all this, but I know what you're thinking. But demons, that has a meta inf. Yes, it does. But this is a good meta inf. You do not want to delete this or it will not work. So there's two ways to doing it here. You can do this and do all that, or you can do it the easy way of taking it and just going control A, select all, and you want to put over here. Okay. So this may take a while, not too long now, so click OK, does that, just X out of both of these. You may want to keep your .minecraft tab though, just so you can get to it with ease. Now you want to start up Minecraft, uh, Minecraft, there we go, and you want to log in. So it should be FML setting up your environment. That's Forge Mod Loader. It may take a little bit first time. Not too long though. So as you can see when it loads up, it gives you this mods thing. Alright. You should not have Flans Mods yet. Sorry. You should just have these. I don't even know why it's there. That's weird. Um, so you should have these three. What you want to do now, you want to quit the game, back to .minecraft, just for tutorial's sake, I will delete fans mod, empty the second bin real quick, okay, so now it should give me this for it says mods, oh my gosh, I'm, what are these, I haven't even done this yet, I'm so sorry guys, I don't even know what's going on right now. So I could already know what's going on. But, um, so what you want to do, you want to open your mods folder that it just gave you. You want to find Flans mod right here. Just want to drag that in. And you want to X out of that. You don't want to X out, you want to tap that. Sorry. I'm just going to have to go back into, um, dot Minecraft now. You want to log in. You should set up your environment. Okay. I should have four mods. It would have said three before, but now you have four. So now you have Flans mod. Okay, you just want to quit the game now. You want to go back to that Minecraft. And now what you want to do? Now you got a Flan folder. It should give you a Flan folder. Now. With that, you just want to double click that. You should have properties. For this, it's, you don't need to really even worry about this. But it's for like explosions, bombs. If you want them on, just keep it true. If not, just want to type in 
files and then click file save but I'm not going to do that because I'm fine with the explosions so what you want to do now this is where all the magic happens right here okay so you're done with minecraft forge what you want to do now is the packs that you got so simple parts world war 2 and modern weapons you want to just highlight all those right click open so just spam me up right here all the things you open come over here put that there put them all over here and so here comes the easy part all right ready you take the pack one by one drag it over it's there you can hit x for that on weapons drag it over x for that parts pack drag it over x for that now you're done all you gotta do now is go to open up your minecraft launch it you should set up your environment for one last time until you uninstall mods or something like that and it should load now you should have it should say four mods you've done it completely correct don't worry all right let me just delete that and delete that and now it's done the world just put a lot of cheats on done all right so you wanna, I'm going to do this for tutorial's sake. So you want to create a new world. As I said, I was going to show the, you around the mod a little bit. So it should build the terrain real quick. So once you're in here, go to game mode 1 or creative. And if you've done it correctly, you should have this. One out of two pages. Now when you go over, you should have plans mod guns mod vehicles mod parts and mod team stuff that's how you know you've done it correct so with the guns look at all this you got all the guns the bombs so anyway if you like the commentary and are new to the channel subscribe for more uh like if you want to and anyway this has been sound x demons and i will see you guys next time.